Hello and good morning. I wonder how many of you still do the April Lead Code Challenge. This is now day 22, start of week 4. We have 9 more days to go, I think. Or 10. Uh, 9 should be 9. Problem will be Sabare sum equals k. I'm back with a timer. Today it will not be that interesting, but for the week 4 I want to, uh, again, time myself. This will be just Maximum Sabarai. In, I don't know if you remember, in the third video of this month, Maximum Sabarai, I showed you an alternative solution involving prefix sums. And this is what will be useful here. Given an array and k, you need to find the total number of continuous Sabarais whose sum equals to k. And you might remember that Sabarai sum is equal, so Sabarai from L to R, it's equal prefix of r minus prefix of l minus 1. So I wonder how many there are differences such that this is true. And this becomes for every, let's say, r from 0 to n. And will be size of the array. So n is nums of dumps dot size. I want this to be equal to k. So uh, let me transform this pref of r minus pref of l minus 1 is equal k. I know pref of r because I'm currently at r. So pref of l minus 1 is pref of r minus k. This is what I need. So I need pref of r minus k. And I wonder how many l's there are on the left such that this is true. And I will say answer plus equal uh, count occurrences, count pref, let's say, of need. In the end, return answer. Sometimes it's good to do a problem like this, like step by step in some random order. Just add what, whatever you need. Pref of r. Uh, actually, I don't need an array for prefix sums. I can just um, count the cumulative sum. So pref plus equal nums of r. Now pref is the sum of numbers up to the current position r. What about count pref? This should be a map or an ordered map to get linear complexity. Count pref. And here every time count pref of uh, pref plus plus. Now this counts the number of times this prefix sum occurred so far. One more thing is empty prefix should also be considered. And uh, if values could be just positive in the sequence, then we could use two pointers. But if they are negative as well, this is, I think, the only possible solution. Accepted. Oh, I messed up the timer. Uh, 223. Let's see hints. Will brute force work here? Try to optimize it. Can we optimize by using some extra space? Some frequencies in a hash table. Mm. Yeah, just from prefix sums, you need to then say, okay, for every R, I need the count of those such that it's exactly some particular value. And if you want more about it, then also maybe rewatch the third video in this month. And that's it for today. A shorter video after two longer ones in two previous days. Mm. Let me know in the comments how are you doing in this challenge. Did you miss one day, zero, a few of those? I think there's like, if you have 25 problems or more, you are okay for some price and then 30 days without any day skipped, it's some extra price, a raft. I don't remember. You can read yourself in the rules of this contest. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed the video and see you tomorrow. Bye bye.